Hey, welcome back. Uh, this is Doki, well, uh, this is Doki Doki again. Uh, I brought my editor with me this time. Hello. Hello. Um. Yeah. Um. So we're just gonna play through it. Um. Yeah. So. Yeah. Uh, chirp up anytime you want to. I will. <laughs> yeah. It's already. It's already tilted. Oh, great. Oh, oh, no, it's starting. Oh. Yeah, it's starting. No. Hi again, oh. Bill. Glad to see you didn't run away on us. Haha. <laughs> nah, don't worry. This might be a little strange for me, but I, I at least kept my word. And I brought somebody else with me. Hello. I am yes. now trapped in here, too. <laughs> yeah, we are now stuck. Stuck. Stutch? We are now stuck in this game dimensional hell. <laughs> Which I don't know why we wanted that, but we are oh, stuck in here. I can't look at the screen for too long. Oh my lord. Yeah, no, that's completely fine. I have to. I know. Well, oh, I feel bad for your eyeballs. Yeah, no, uh, it's not my eye. Well, I'm not concerned about my eyeballs. I'm concerned about my stomach and like everything oh. else. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm back at the literature club. I was the last one to come in, so everyone else is already hanging out. Hi, who have hmm. Gay. Is her, is her face good, Yuri? Yeah? Okay, good. Thanks for keeping- thanks for keeping your promise, Bill. I hope this isn't too, oh, too overwhelming of a commitment for you. Making you dive headfirst into literature when you're not accustomed to it. Oh, also! Um, I should say, <laughs> my mic is very much away from me because of, like, my editor is quiet, um, so mm. I just, like, cranked up the volume on my mic, um, so, rip headphone users, hey editor, heads up, uh, I did that, so, it's not this, ah, uh, Jesus, <laughs> Ex exactly, just all the time, <laughs> um, Definitely putting, like, a, a text warning in there. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> and we also tried to do this. So that's why the skip is here. <laughs> but we didn't realize... Uh, we didn't get the... We didn't get... Um, we didn't get my audio. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so audio it was just me talking to the void. <laughs> just... Hello, darkness, my old friend, and nothing else. <laughs> I'm like, oh my god, this is not good. Um, it was just hello, darkness, and the darkness was not responding. Yeah, you, you, you okay, Monica? Or not to keep, not Monica, God. Oh, come on, like he deserves any slack. You already had to be, you already had to be dragged here by Monica. I brought someone else, give me some slack now. <laughs> Yeah, just uh, this tilt, zoom in, turn. It's oh, it's so bad. Oh, it's still going. It, yeah, it's oh my god. I don't know if you plan just to come here to hang out uh, or what, but if you don't take us seriously, then you won't see the end of it. Why are you over the text? Why are you what? over it? No, why? Oh god. Natsuki, that's certainly Bob something. <laughs> yeah, Natsuki, some things certainly have a big mouth for someone who keeps probably a manga collection in the club room. Why are you over the text? I don't know! This is, this is hell! I don't like this! No! Why, why is she also smaller than everyone else? <laughs> oh my god, I didn't realize that. <laughs> Natsuki finds herself being stuck between saying Monica and manga. Manga is literature! Swiftly defeated, Natsuki plops back into her seat. I'm sorry, Bill. We'll make sure you're... We... <laughs> stupid. There's like a stupid stray hair <laughs> that just <clears throat> flies into my mouth and I'm like... <clears throat> yeah. We'll make sure to put your comfort first, okay? Yuri shoots Natsuki a disappointed glance. Um, anyway, not that you're in the club and all, 
Perhaps you might have interest in picking up a book to read? Well, I can't really say no either way. Like you said, I'm in this club now. Excuse me. Excuse uh, you. So it only feels right for me to do something like that, if you ask. W wait, I didn't mean it like that. Ooh. If you don't really want to, then then you can just forget I said anything, I guess. Ah, no, not like that. You beautiful, beautiful person, you. Really? You're not going to make, make fun of- Did I lose you? No, I still care. I'm just trying not to. <laughs> I was fully expecting you to, like, make fun of me. Yeah, I decided not to, this once. Huh, okay. But now um, that you've said it, I'm going to. Alright. I want to try to be part of this club. So even if I don't read often, I'd be happy to pick up a book if, even if you wanted me to. Uh, are you sure? I just felt like... Well, as vice president and all... Okay, I'm gonna be honest. Yuri feels, a, feels like a much better person to be vice president over Sayori. Yeah, like, I love Sayori and all, but, like, Yuri is better as vice president. <laughs> yeah, like, I, I, like, sure, I could see Sayori being, like, a secretary, secretary or something like that. Definitely not treasurer, but something along that line. Something along just, the like, lines like, of, you write things down, and then and immediately the, forget them anyway. Yeah, and, and just being a part of the higher council type thing of the club. Yeah. But, like, just vice president does not fit Sayori. No. Uh, that I should help you get started on something you might like. Yuri reaches into our bags and pulls out a book. Is that the Nep... Nep... Yeah. Is that the Nepnomicon? Yep, that one. <laughs> <laughs> eh, close enough. <laughs> yeah. I didn't want you to feel left out. So I picked out a book I th that I thought you might enjoy. Uh, it's a short read, so uh, it should keep you. I'm a baby! <laughs> I'm like, hey, look, it's a book! Hey, look, a video game! Hey, look, car keys! Now I want milk! <laughs> Not that! How dare you treat me as such, Yuri! <laughs> when I was like, ah, this beautiful queen this that has purple hair, how fucking dare you! <laughs> <laughs> and we could, you know, discuss it if you want. What? What? I imagine, like, what? You want to talk about a nine page long book? Really? <laughs> this, this, this is. How is this girl accidentally being so cute? She picked out a book she thinks I'll like, despite me not reading much. Y Yuri. Thanks, thank you. I'll, I'll definitely start reading this. I enthusiastically take the book. Phew. Well, you can read it at your own pace. Yeah, knowing that, with you treating me like a baby, I might read it word for word. Like, <laughs> the dog. <laughs> because that's what you, I, because I guess that's what I am in your eyes. Just a freaking two-year-old. <laughs> I look forward to hearing what you think. <laughs> God! And oh, now that Jesus. it's not tilted anymore, my brain is like, oh yeah, it needs to be tilted. Like, it got used... Oh, there we go. It got used to the other version. Yeah. <laughs> like, I was looking away from the screen and everything, and I was like, my eyes are used to the tilt. And then I look back and, uh oh. Yeah, it's just like... <laughs> yeah, but it's... Look at the, the snap is hard for me because I'm like, ha, ha, right, this is reality. <laughs> uh, now that everyone's settled in, I expect Monica to kick off some scheduled activities for the club. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Yuri's face is already buried in a book. I can't help but notice her intense expression like she's waiting for this chance. Meanwhile, Natsuki is rummaging around the closet. I'm curious to talk to Yuri a little bit more. 
But at the same time, I would feel bad for distracting her from reading. I catch a glimpse of the cover of her book. It looks like the same book that she lent to me. More than that, it seems she seems to be on the first few pages. Uh, uh crap. I think she noticed me looking at her. She she sneaks another glance at me, and our eyes meet for a split second. But that, that only makes her hide her face deeper in the book. Sorry. Okay, is it just me? But did her... And I'm not, like, staring straight at it. But my... Like, when I, like, look at her and then read the text, my brain is, like... It's, like, square. Square. So it sees the part that overlaps. Did her boobs actually get bigger? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, maybe? I haven't been looking, so I don't know. Yeah, like, neither have I, but just, I quickly noticed it, and I'm like, wait. Just have they? Hold on. Are you looking it up right now? No, I'm not. I was just trying to be funny. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I might later and then like put it in the actual video and just like while I'm editing it, just like yes or no. Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah, I you I might want you to put a like a side by side type thing. I'll try. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> like yeah, definitely do it if you could. I muttered this, sensing I made her uncomfortable. Uh, oh, that's fine. If I was focused, then I probably wouldn't have noticed you in the first place. But I'm rereading a bit of this, so... That's the book you gave me, right? Mm-hmm. I wanted to reread some of it. Not for any particular reason. Just curious. How come you got two... How come you got two copies of the Satanic Bible? <laughs> uh -huh. Well, when I stopped at that bookstore yesterday... That's not what I meant. I mean... I just happened to buy two of them. Ah. There's something fairly obvious here that Yuri isn't telling me, but I decide to let it go. <laughs> let it go. <laughs> um. I'll definitely start reading it soon. I'm glad to hear. Once it starts to pick up, you might have a hard time putting it down. Really? I thought it was. I thought it was the Satanic Bible or the Necronomicon, not an anti-gravity book. Because I heard those are hard to put down. <laughs> oh, hi, you, uh... It's a very engaging and relatable story. Is that so? What's the story that, about that, anyway? You still there? Yeah, I'm still here. Okay, I'm just... Uh... I'm just watching. Okay. Um. Ah, oh, hi. Hi. Uh, hmm. Well, mm. I look at the cover of the book. The book is titled "Portrait of Markov." There's an ominous eye-looking symbol on the front cover. Basically, it's about this religious religious camp that was turned into a human experiment prison. And the people trapped there have this trait that turns them into killing machines that lust for blood. But the facility gets even worse, and they start selectively breeding people by cutting off their limbs and affixing them to... Uh, that might be a bit of a spoiler. Uh, but anyway, I'm really into it. The, the book, I mean, not the thing about the limbs. <laughs> that's kind of... That's dark and really gory. Especially for, uh, what, is she 17 in this? I think, yeah, she's a senior, like, everyone, there's, like, all the girls are, like, one, like, a different grade or something. Yeah. Yeah, I think, no, isn't Monica the oldest one? I thought she was second oldest. No, I thought Monica was the oldest. Yuri was the second oldest. 
And then it was Sayori, then Natsuki. Oh no, Sayori is the youngest. <laughs> Sayori is the youngest. Lo- Natsuki looks the youngest, but she's like sixteen. <laughs> huh. We're gonna. We're here. You're gonna have to flash up the correct answer. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, um, Yuri made it sound like it was gonna be a nice story, so that dark turn came out of nowhere. Uh, are you not a fan of that sort of thing? No! 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 No, it's not that. I mean, I could definitely enjoy those kinds of stories. Really? So don't worry. I I hope so. Yeah, I totally forgot Yuri is into those things. Into gore and just, okay. Yeah, like... Like this, Yuri. Yuri, I know you're like my dark purple person, but 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 you being into gore, I'm like, mm, no thanks. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, I guess since we're on the top of the topic of the book and like we're with Yuri right now, um, do you believe the theory that Yuri is from the portrait of Markov? It has good points to it. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if I believe it like a hundred percent, but it definitely has some good points in it. Yeah, yeah, same. I like. I'm like. I can see where you're coming from, but I honestly, but like, I just. Like, but that doesn't, that's not enough to convince me that it is. No. Yeah. Um, she, she's so shy and reclusive on the outside, but her mind seems to be, com- seems to be completely different. It's just that kind of story. It, it's the kind of story that challenges, challenges you to look at life from a strange new perspective. How? How does it, that change? It, I. It changes. Well, how it, it makes you think of from the perspective of a murderer. Me? I don't know. I. Now I'm actually curious, and I want to read the book. <laughs> <laughs> Same. I, I. I don't know if it is an actual. I think it is. Um, Future editor. Thing- <laughs> huh? Look it up. Yeah, yeah, editor, look it up. <laughs> uh, when horrible things happen, not b- just because someone wants to be evil, but the world is filled of horrible people, and we're all worthless anyway. Uh, what? Then suddenly, uh, I'm I'm rambling, aren't I? Not again. I'm sorry. Hey, don't apologize. Your mind is just full of error codes. It's fine. You're not evil. <laughs> Monica's just infecting you with a virus. <laughs> I haven't lost interest or anything. Well, I guess it's all right then. But I feel like I should. But I feel like I should let you know that I have this problem. <laughs> when I let books and writing and Monica fill my thoughts, because she's making me think about that. What was that? Uh. It Great. deleted itself. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 read... I saw when my body is something, something, something. I, I, I think I read. Um... Oh, for, I forgot it because I saw it for two seconds. It was a grain in my memory and then just smoothed over. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, but we'll, we'll, be... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we'll be able to see what uh, Yuri said. Um, yeah. Um, I kind of forgot to, I kind of forget to pay attention to other people, so I'm sorry if I end up saying something strange, and please stop me, and please stop me if I start talking too much. That's, I really don't think you need to worry. It just means you're passionate about reading. The least I could do is listen. Yeah. It is a lit- literature club, after all. Yeah. Uh, th- that's, well, that's true. In fact, I might as well. Get to start reading on it, right? Ah, ooh, ah, hmm. I give it. 
I ca I caught that with the other recording. So, editor, timestamp, put it up screen. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, y y yes. I mean, you don't have to, but <laughs> what are you saying? Uh, let me get the book. I quickly retrieved the book that I put in my bag. All right. It's a matter of I sit here, right? <laughs> yeah. I slip into the desk next to Yuri's. Ah, uh, yeah. Are you sure? Are you sure about that? <laughs> um, you seem a little apprehensive. That's... I'm sorry. It's not that I don't want you to. It's just something that I'm not used to. That is, reading in company with someone. I see. Well, just tell me if I end up distracting you or anything. Uh, uh, all right. I open up the book and start the prologue. I soon understand what Yuri means by reading in company. Can we pause for just a second? Sure. Just tell me if I end up distracting you. Boy, you are distracting her. Yeah, That's fair. That's the whole reason she noticed that you were staring at her. Because she's not focused on the book. She's looking at you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah, like. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> It's as if I can feel her presence over my shoulder as I read. It's just like she's absorbing me and glitching into <laughs> me. Um, it's not a particularly bad thing. Maybe a little distracting, but the feeling is somewhat comforting. Have you yeah, the feeling ever, of just like, going glitch, glitch, glitch. <laughs> yeah, it's just like... Oh, ha, nah. um, have you ever, like, co-read... Um, with someone, like the like the like the only time I've like co-read is like when in school and just like for silent reading. I have both in school for silent reading and at home. Mm. But it was mainly just for school, and it was like, oh, my mom also reading that book, so let's just start from the beginning. Got it. Yeah. Um. Yeah, uh, Yuri, Yuri is in the corner of my eye. Ow! God damn it, Yuri! Get your shoulder out of my eye. <laughs> I realize that she's not actually looking at her own book. I glance over. It looks like she's reading from my book instead. S sorry, I was just breathing in that, breathing in the body of your heat. You, Yuri, you real, you apo you really apologize a lot, don't you? I, I, I do. I don't mean to. Sorry. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> y Yuri! Okay, I, I kind of figured out what girl is what type. Like, Yuri is the stereotypical um, introvert. Mm -hmm. Monica is the stereotypical extrovert. Uh, Natsuki is like... She's more introverted, but she's, but she's like a bold introvert. Like she's not like shy and reclusive. She'll be like, "Oh yeah, what what do you want, punk?" But <laughs> like, just, I don't know, something else. And then Mon, uh, not Monica, um, Sayori. Sayori is the introvert. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Here. Here, this should work, right? I slide my desk into until it's up against Yuri's, then hold my book more between the two of them. Ah, uh, I, I suppose so. Yuri timidly closes her own copy. Once we each lean in a bit, our shoulders are almost touching. It feels like my left arm is in the way, so instead I use my right hand to open the book. I, I guess that makes it kind of difficult to turn the page. Here. Yuri takes her left arm and holds the left side of the book between her thumb and forefinger. Ah. I do the same with my right arm on the right side of the book. Yeah. So what we're doing, like, what me and Yuri are doing is kind of really hard. Wouldn't you say, or agree? Yeah, but, like, I'm just, 
I'm thinking, like, joke-wise, am I just over there in the corner? <laughs> I don't know, maybe. Yuri, I'm just over there on the computer in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, like, just co-reading one book is hard because two people speeds and difficulty. Yeah. Yeah. The, the papers look like error codes. Yeah, I do. I don't know. Yeah, I just thought I should point that out because I was like, huh. Neat. Neat. Um, yeah, uh, but holding it like this, or huddled even closer than before, it's actually kind of distracting me. It, it's as if I can feel the warmth of Yuri's face. She's in the corner of my vision. Uh, are you ready? Eh? She turned the page. Ah, sorry. I just got distracted for a second. I feel like you're gonna absorb me. Please don't. <laughs> I don't want to be sucked into a vacuum. No! <laughs> I glance over Yuri's face again, and our eyes meet. I don't know how I'll be able to keep up with her. Ah, uh, that's okay. You're not to use you're not used to reading, right? I don't mind being patient if it takes you a bit longer. It's it's the, probably the least I could do. Since you're you've been so patient with me. Yeah. Thanks. We continue reading. Yuri is no longer asking if I'm ready to turn the page. Instead, I assume that she finishes the page before me, so I turn it on my own volition. Uh, we continue the first chapter in silence. Even so, trying each page almost feels like an intimate exchange. Um, by thumb, gently letting go of the page, letting it flutter over her side as she catches it under her own thumb. Hey, Yuri. This might be a silly thought, but... The main character kind of reminds me of you a little bit. <laughs> no, I don't relate to this character at all. Definitely not. Really? I was just thinking the way she second guesses things she says. I'm saying things correctly. <laughs> uh, and all that. Uh, uh, that. That's what you were talking about. Yeah. Sorry, I thought you meant something else about her. Something else. Never mind. We didn't even get that far yet, so I don't even know why that came into my head. <laughs> <laughs> Yuri, are you feeling all right? Yes? No? The coding in my brain is having an error. No! <laughs> eh? Uh, Yuri seems a little bit fidgety ever since we started reading. You can rest if, you feel, if you're feeling sick or something. The breathing is a little... M my breathing? Yuri puts her hand on her chest as if to feel her heartbeat. I... I... I didn't even notice. Anyway, I'm fine. I just need some water. All right, don't push yourself. I guess, okay, I guess this is obvious, but who would you, like, and I know we talked about it off camera, but who would you date? Sayori. <laughs> Sayori? Yeah. It's obvious who I would date. Yes, yes, it is. <laughs> okay, you don't have to say it like it's, like, I, like I'm pointing a neon... Like have I like I have a neon sign above my head. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh Yuri stands up and practically rushes out of the classroom. What on earth was that about? Um Oh god, what was your voice? Bill? Bill? Bill Bill? Bill Nye the science guy. Bill, Bill. <laughs> <laughs> Something happened just now, Kitty. Yes, that stray hair flew into my mouth again. Ew. <sighs> eh? I have, I have no idea. Yuri was acting a little strange, I guess. So you don't know anything. Sorry, I can't say I do. Are you worried about her? Uh, yes? Or, no, that was me. Right? Yeah, 
Sorry, I can't say I do. Are you worried about her? There we go. Oh, no, not really. I was just making sure you didn't do anything to her. I am not the one who has glitchy, Whoa! glitchy, glitchy universe power. What? <laughs> Did I miss something? No, just... Whoa there, Monica, that's a big accusation. <laughs> yeah, I'm not the one with glitchy, glitchy, controlling universe powers of this game. <laughs> no, nothing. <laughs> don't believe, don't worry, I believe you, silly. Yuri just does this sometimes, so it's nothing alarming. All right, if you say so, I guess. Anyway, why don't we start sharing our poems with each other? Eh? Shouldn't we wait for Yuri? Well, she might be a while, so I figured we, we'd we get started without her. Is that okay? Yeah, I, I guess. I was just asking. I stand up. I make, a ment I make a mental note of where I left off in the book and then slip it back into my bag. Well, we are going to save here. And then continue. Oh, wait, hold on. Speaking of poems, editor, flash, put up the poem that is that I got randomly generated. I forgot poem, like secret special poems are randomly generated. Put up the poem. <laughs> um, I, I sent it to you. I know I did. Um, yeah, you did. I could, I could have sworn there was something else. I can't, well, I can't remember it, but anyway, that's going to do it for this video. Um, I have, so, leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, um, ring the bell for notifications so you can see the future rest of Doki Doki. Um, yeah. Um, some other channel, some other stuff I played on the channel are Human Benchmark, um, Benji and the Ink Machine. Without a voice, please don't, please don't touch anything. And I made some tier list videos. Um, but yeah, that I sh I'll let that. Yeah. Um, do you want to say anything before, like, I end the video? Um. Not that I can think of now. <laughs> okay, that's fair. Uh, so I guess with that. We will see you guys in the next issue. See ya! Bye!